thank you for organizing this. Thank all of you for turning out today. Um, listening to those stories is uh, intensely personal for every one of us who are here, uh, myself, my staff included, uh, with maybe one exception, I think uh, a case of an alum who preceded me uh, as the dean. I recognized all of the stories. I know the students involved. I remember in detail the deep, long discussions we had amongst our group, trying as best we could to figure out how to deal with moments of crisis for students. What I can tell you is that it pains every one of us. I'm, I'm in pain right now, and so you have reached me just thinking about the difficulties that each of you, many of you, go through in your times at Rice. For each of us, I will speak for myself, but also for my staff. The reason why we do what we do is because we love the students at Rice. I've been here much longer than you guys have been alive in most cases. This is, this is my career, this is my dedication. I became Dean of Undergraduates here because I wanted to help in the lives of students. I wanted to help with the culture here. I wanted to help the ways in which you interact with each other and support each other. That's my mission, and I can tell you as well that I have a wonderful team of people for whom that is their mission as well. But we are also all self-aware enough to know that we can always do better, that we can always reassess and reevaluate what we do. And I can say as well as a teacher that I learn as much from my students as hopefully they learn from me. And as a consequence, you know, an open conversation as the four of you have helped us organize here is in fact the best way that we could learn from each other. I clearly don't want to talk about any students' individual cases here, but what I do want to do is 